Bonk's Fun Box welcomes you to the following presentation of the National Heavy Boxing League. Hey, did any of you see that soccer game from yesterday? Well, it was good, but it's not going to be as much as the crowd as this National Heavy Boxing League Sasha League Championship. Spider! to the Sasha Heavyweight Championship of the National Heavy Boxing League Season 3. Tonight, we will see the epic standoff to Super Snake and Woo! Gotta be sneaky. But before we do anything, let's introduce our guest commentators. He is the co-owner of Bonk's Fun Box and the creator of the National Heavy Boxing League. He is my friend on Steam. Give it up for the Germans for all. And now for our second commentator. He is the brother to the Gentleman's Fedora. And he's also part of referee for the National Heavy Boxing League. Give it up for Magic on the Bird. Commentator is a YouTuber. He lost in the first round of, of season three of the NHBL. But he's here to party tonight. Give it up for Shade Pony Singer. And our last guest is kind of on the creepy pasta side. He is a famous YouTuber, and he's one of our guest commentators for the night. He didn't make Princess Molestia follow him tonight. Here's a four. Season 3 has been an amazing and very fast season. As Bonk Nicholson has said, tonight's epic matchup is between the one and only Super Snake representing the Soviet Russian Heavy Boxing Conference and Woo, gotta be sneaky, representing the National Heavy Boxing Conference. Today is going to be an epic matchup, but before we see their rage come out on the ring, we shall honor both Soviet Russia and America by listening to both of their national anthems. We'll start off with the Soviet Russian national anthem.
And now, we shall listen to the American National Anthem. by my very own sister, Jericho. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangle banner yet wave or the land of the free and the home of the brave I'm in tears ladies and gentlemen <laughs> Okay, so, tonight, as I said, and as Bonk Nickel to this said, it's going to be the epic matchup. Now, gentlemen, thank you for joining me alongside me to commentate tonight. It's a great pleasure to have you tonight. Tonight, again, is going to be the best match in the NHBO. It's the biggest. And honestly, I have seen both of these fighters. I've been to every single yes, match in the NBA. And I think it's going to be Mr. Sneaky tonight. Because if you can manage to beat the rook first rookie to win the Sasha Heavyweight Championship, then you can manage to win anything. What, I, what do you think, Mr. Gonzo? Derp. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm new to this, but uh, I'll do my best to keep up with it. Uh, from what I hear of this event, I heard it's going to be a great, great event, and I'm I'm glad to be here and to check this out. All right, what about you, Mr. Magic? What do you think? Well, in my opinion, Sneaky is uh, not very sneaky. I think that it'll be Snake who comes out on top of this. It is very much oh, determined course. by their outfits. How the hell? Yeah. Well, uh, as soon as we get everyone in the ring, we'll continue commentating for you. Now, let me ask, now, Mr. Shade, what do you think of tonight's match? Who do you think is going to win it all? I've said it once and I fail it and I'll say it again. Everything can happen in NACL. And I think it's going to be the best versus the beast. Indeed. And now, and ladies and gentlemen, before we can, before we introduce our referee and fighters, we're going to tell you about our sponsors. First, first look, Mr. Shade Pony Singer is going to tell us about our main sponsor and the server we're on right now. All right, this match is brought to you part by Bounce Fun Box. One small box. Slap my hand. Damn good fun. Bonk's Fun Box. It's also brought to you by Livestream Group. Play hard, rage quit, and enjoy life. Livestream Group. And most importantly, it's brought to you by the Star Bronies on a quest for stardom. The Star Bronies. And now, let's introduce our referee. He's the younger brother of Filmer Bonk Nicholson. And he's going to be co head referee next year. Give it up for the one, the only, LePyro! And now, we're going to introduce our away team advantage. He 
is the per he is the fighter who beat the first rookie to win the Sasha Heavyweight Championship. The one and only white Russian mayor of power in the conference finals. And he is making a match for the NHBL, representing the National Heavy Boxing Conference. Give it up for Woo! Gotta be sneaky! Now it's time to announce our home field advantage. He's my twin brother. He has proven himself as a true NHBL fighter. And he's ready to fight and kick Sneaky's ass tonight. Give it up for my twin brother, Super Snake. He's going to win this match, but after, even if his look is kind of ridiculous, but he got a light show for crying out loud. I think it's going to be Snake here winning tonight's match. What do you think, Gonzo? Yes. Well, I don't know any of them personally, but I do wish both of them a good, clean fight. No! All right, what about you, Mr. Magic? Oh, I don't know, man. I think Snake is the coolest looking greaser of these two guys, though. Sneaky, Sneaky's got a pretty fearsome looking head. Honestly, I think this could go either way. Indeed. What about you, Mr. Shade? Oh, Mr. Shade left. Alright, well, it looks like we'll just take over from here. Go ahead, Mr. Referee, even though you're supposed to be neutral. Well, when I think of fearsome, I think of, like, Tom can fight. But when I look at Sneaky's load up, I see a chicken hat. And when I think of chicken, the first thing I think of is a wimp. But he beat Russian. He beat Russian, that, that's indeed. He beat Russian, that's indeed. But you never know. And Snake's loadout looks cool, because it looks like he just got that cool looking belt. And he has that, that Johnny Bravo hair with those cool glasses of his. So, you never know. All right, and now we shall go down the back to La Pyro to kick us off for round one of the amazing Sasha Heavyweight Championship. Sasha Heavyweight Championship. Okay, remember, you guys, it's, what's the, is it 6 out of 12? 5 out of 11? 6 out of 11. 6 out of 11, boys. No set, you said much of the match. No trash talk, no spitting. If you spit, you're out of my ring. Hey! I okay. spit away from you. There is blood on my my uh, ring, and I hope to have more blood from you guys fighting. So, on the swing! And there we go. Wait for the swing! Go! And here we go. The start of this amazing match. No punches yet. Seems pretty quiet. And punches have been thrown. All punches are being thrown. Sneaky wins round one. It is now 1-2-0, and Sneaky is in the lead. Uh, like I said for, for the match, Sneaky has, has the most points here, and looks like he could win. You guys still keep your opinions after just one measly round? Yeah. I think I had a sudden call, call, so I'm a little out. All right. And now we'll go back to Lapyro to kick off round two, and then the halftime. Well, right, this so is go. just shocking, you know, because you got the chicken, and you got the Johnny Bravo, and you got blood and things. No spitting, trash shot, snake, just because you're is a mini trash shot. And you got snake, good luck, you could still win. Sneaky, you could still win. It's a close game. Now. On the top, use your sandwiches after the round. <laughs> Fight! And here we go. Round two. The epic matchup. Sneaky has the advantage. Means he has the mental victory. Punches have been thrown. Incoming! Looks like Sneaky is lacking a bit on health here. Oh, wow. Sneaky wins round two. 
and it Look. is two to zero. And remember, Craig's way to round three. And it's two to zero. Stinky is in the lead, and this looks like it's going to be an amazing match. I think well, it's still going to be Stinky in this. Thank you for the sandwich. He's even way. supportive of giving us snacks. What about you, Mr. Gonzo? You think it's going to still go to Mr. Stinky? Well, it looks like uh, during this round, we normally chickens don't fly, but they can sure combat. I think he pretty oh, much proved oh, oh, oh. it in this round as well. Good point. What about you, Mr. Magic? I think it looks like Snake's confidence is a bit low. He's he's being a little dodgy, not very upfront. He needs to ha take a more direct approach to this, or he's probably not going to do very well. Good point. And now we shall go down the Lapyro for round three before our halftime show. Well, I was actually watching the Thoughts Heavyweight last year, and I saw Sandwich just walk up there and beat him two times in a row. Snake could do that, but he could win. And uh, Sneaky could be like Russian beating him. You never know. But no spinning. No trash talking. No using sandwiches after the round. Sir, yes, sir. And Snake, are you ready? You've done me proud, yeah. boys. Are you ready, Sneaky? Today is a uh, good uh, day. Yeah. Incoming! Chicken. Okay, when I jump under the ring. Outstanding. Incoming! Let's buck, buck, buck. Go, 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 go. Incoming! Oh, 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 oh. Alrighty. Oh my goodness, advantage three rounds to zero to Sneaky. Wow. It's quite a big deficit to come back from. It's quiet. No one's like really cheering. It's just like. Now that I am a surprise. Sneaky appears to be in a lacking direction. It looked like he was a little chicken out there, but it looks like he's got a good defense. Or seems he's keeping on bobbing and weaving, and that's one of the keys. Yes. Yeah, I think he's landing more and more, way more than Snake is. I think Snake Snake's is. confidence level has gone down from 100% to 25. What do you guys think? Quite. That seems. Indeed. Now, where is Mr. Fedora? They Either that Snake slim. could catch up, no. or the chicken He's could disappeared run. for the moment. You know, I, I need a name. Well, everybody, oh, yeah. for the halftime show, hey, Mr. Easy. Copiano has appeared. And now, presented by the National Heavy Boxing League, played by a famous singer, this is the Fedora, will sing a song on his piano.
Oh, and ladies and gentlemen, after that halftime show, we shall continue our amazing fight. Between the... It, right now, it is three to nothing. Sneaky is in the lead. It, it, would, take a, it would take a miracle for Snake to come back, to win four matches in a... to win three matches in a row, or... to win three matches in a row to make it back. It's very unlikely. Hopefully, he will be able to come back. What do you guys think? Gonzo... I'm still uh, in shock of that halftime show. Sorry, I'm not a big Elton John fan. All right, Magic, what do you think? I think that our good friend Snake just needs a big pep talk. If he had a trainer or coach somebody like that to get his butt in gear and motivate him, I think he could take this. Anybody what about you, Mr. Shade? What do you think? About the match? Yes, it's three to zero. Sneaky is in the lead. Oh, um, well, Sneaky, he could possibly win it, but who knows? I certainly don't. And now we shall go back down the lip pyro to kick off round four. I think that hand doesn't mean anything. I don't like Fedora said. I had to screw you, Fedora. Oh, uh, look, Dark Cat. As I said, he's a chicken. He doesn't look like one. Ned could still make it back, though. He's got freshmen on his side. He's gonna touch him up and try to be sneaky. Well, no trash talking, no spitting, and Medic, get out of here. Come here, Medic. And no trash talk or spitting, you just sandwiches after the match. And Mr. Sneaky, are you ready, Mr. Chicken? I am Okay, I guess. Snake, are you ready? No, no. When I say the cock. Here we go. Round four. The amazing matchup for Sasha Heavyweight Championship. There it certainly seems that they're just looking for an opening. And, uh, is, is Sneaky trying, is Sneaky singing down there? I think he's not. I think they're spilling on my half dime. This has gone from a wrestling match to a musical. Uh-huh. All right, here we go. Now, punches need to be thrown yet, an outlet must become open. Still nothing yet. I'm not even sure if Sneaky is looking for an opening. I think Snake gives his strategy. There's a punch. I'm not sure. Thrown. Punches are being thrown by both fighters. Punches being. Oh, just one more. That's all he needs is one. Oh dear. One more. Snake looks like he may be aiming for a comeback here. Though so I still am in favor of Sneaky. What do you think, Gonzo? Well, it looks like he managed to come out this round. He managed to put that chicken right in his rightful place, right next to the mashed potatoes and gravy. Yeah. What about you, Mr. Magic? What do you think? Oh, goodness. I think that was the pep talk he needed right there. All he has to do is win, uh, I think, five out of the next rounds. He need, yes, he, he needs to win... The he needs to win five more, five rounds in a row if he wants to win, or just five in general, separated. But he needs to be careful about what he does, though. What about you, Mr. Shade? I honestly hope Snake does win because I hope he wins it for his brother. Good point. And now we shall go down to the ring to, for Lapyro to kick off round five. Oh, doesn't look as bad as he thinks. Snake just knew his strategy and he started doing this too. Well, Sneaky, you don't have the Bacock hat on anymore. You have that gangsta hat, Couch Capper. Now you think you're, you're a gangster, so you're ready to come back and beat him. Or Snake could just be like, have a skull count and win. No spitting. No throwing up on each other. No getting blown on my... Oh, God, not again. Please do not get blown on my thing, or you probably will. Hey, Snap. But, uh, I'm the gangster thingy. Gangster thingy! Gangster thingy! Thanks, Doc. I said gangster thingy. Gangster yeah, thingy! Go! go. <laughs> Here we go. Round well, five. Let's see how this West Side Story begins. And it looks like they come straight in. They don't try to... Sticky wins round five! Oh. And it is tied four to one. Sticky wins. needs two more rounds to win. Sticky needs to get himself together. Otherwise, he's not going to be able to make it back from this. What do you think, Mindless? Do you think he can make it back? Uh, maybe. I mean, he lucked out on the last round, but unfortunately, 
I don't, I don't think his luck is going to last this round or the next. You, know, you, do, you do have a decent point on that. What about you, Magic? Oh, he's got to win quite a few of the next few rounds to do this. He's got to be quite motivated to win it if he wants to. I, I think it's a long shot. What about you, Shade? Hmm. Well, it's still going to be neck and neck. I think Nate could possibly make a comeback like last time. But, you know. All right, and now we shall kick it down to Lapyro for round six. Round six, my gosh. Is this going to turn up like last year? It's 4-2 last year. Will Snake win and make it 4-2? We'll find out. Snake, doing great. Push and you'll win. Sneaky, you push, you'll win. Well, blow. No spitting, no throwing up. Don't you dare! Okay, uh, use the sandwiches after the round. I ate your spit. Sorry, fellas. Boys, you got this. Well, go! Here we go. Round six or seven. I don't know what round it is anymore. I think if memory counts, like it's six. And no. it's sneaky! It looks like it is 5 to 1 now. Sneaky has one more round to win and he can claim it all. The, the, the top dog, he could be the top dog. Claim the rights to the championship. Representing his time as well. And then having the right to the. No, 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 we beat you. All right, what do you think, Martin Lusconzo? You think it's going to be sneaky or do you think there is a slight chance that Snake can make it back? Um, it's hard, really hard to tell right now. Right now, I'm getting pissed on at me for the love of God. I hate this. Preston, calm down, please. But right now, all I can safely say is. Good luck to whoever managed to land the last punch. Alright, what about you, Mr. Magic? I don't know, I think it's an even further shot from here. Snake looks uncoordinated. He, he's not landing very many blows. I think he really needs to get his act together if he's going to win this. What about you, Shade? What do you think? Shay, okay, um, Snake, I like you, but I'm sorry to, but, but I think... Sneaky's gonna win. What the hell is this? The heavy boxing league or American? Oh, dancing with stars. Uh, <laughs> all right, and now we'll go down to the pyro for round seven. My heart is beating. Thanks, you have to make it back, and Sneaky, you have to win. Just letting you know, there is another match after this. It's called the Sandwich Bowl. Get away. You miss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so uh, you guys will be facing each other in the sandwich bowl. So Snake, if you win, you guys are both good. That's all that matters. Well, round six, the moment of truth. No, round seven, the moment of truth. Sneaky, no spitting. Snake, no spitting. No scratch shotting for both of you. Hey, hey, you have to do this every time. Oh god, a snake wins while they deal with another spit. Okay. Oh, snake went, by the way. Uh, so, well, you sandwiches after the match. Ow. When I, I, let me get in here. Jump out of the ring. Here we go. Round six, round seven. The moment of truth. Who will win the Sasha Heavyweight Championship? Will the sneaky be able to keep it, or will Snake be able to keep it? Wait a we have some problems. I think Sneaky is going to keep it. Really? He's, he's, he's going all over the <laughs> ring! He's like, he doesn't even know where he is! Here we go. Punches being extremely thrown. Could Sneaky win this? It's a hard decision now. Looks like Sneaky has a bit of his health gone, but I don't know about Sneaky. Oh dear! Throw up is all over the ring. I think... He is surprised even with alcohol he can manage to be good in this round. It's ridiculous. Here we go. Punches being thrown. Oh, uh, keep it going, and it is five to two right now, and it looks as if it's going to be an amazing game today. Five to two. It looks like Snake may keep this round, but I still have my favorite sleeper. What about you, Gonzo? I'm starting to believe that Snakey might have some venom left and might be able to pull out a much-needed victory for this matchup. All right, what about you, Magic? 
Oh my goodness, I think this may be the start of a momentum, a, a large push. It might just turn out well for Stank. Alright, and what about you, Mr. Shade? Well, I think, okay, this is clearly a big, uh, NBA, NHBL final. This will be the first Sasha Heavyweight Championship that is that is a final decision, tiebreaker decision. I still think it's going to be sneaky, and I think he's just letting up so that Snake will have a little bit of grace. What do you think, Marlon Gonzo? I don't even know what Sneaky is thinking right now. I think he's still a little bit wasted for the past two rounds. Nope, just puking my face right now. I'm getting spit on me right well enough. Just puking my face. Mm. <laughs> I, but we got a little crop. We just got a word that um, Sneaky is actually having stomach problems. Could this be a big up for Snake? I don't Again. know, but we go down to Lepiro for round nine. Sorry, Russian. Okay, round nine. Go home, Sneaky, you're drunk. Snake, you got this. You got this. <laughs> Yeah, you got this. You're just roaring and you're just putting on the No, I'm, not, I'm just not gonna say it. No, it's fine. Uh, you're trying to the round. No trash talk. Sneaky, are you ready? Yeah, I'm good. Let's do this. You're ready, Snake. Yes. Let's go, my Snake? Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, it is five, Ooh. two, three. Incoming. When I taught with this, uh, it was slapping my leg. <laughs> And thank you for the free food once again, Sneaky. Here we go. Punches are being- are- and not being punished. And there's a punch! One single punch being thrown. And Sneaky with the Sasha Heavyweight Championship! 6-2-3! The drunkard Sneaky- Who gotta be Sneaky has won! The Sasha Heavyweight Championship has won it all! Congratulations, Mr. Sneaky! You won the Sasha Heavyweight Championship! Mr. Oh, Sneaky, I'm going to ask you a few questions. Firstly, what was your strategy while you were out there? What made you decide What made you decide that you wanted to be a part of the What made you decide that you needed to live What was your strategy? What was your battle plan? I'm going to ask you a few questions. To you, Mr. Sneaky, you have won the Sasha Heavyweight Championship, and let me ask you this. Are you ready for the Sunwich Bowl next week? Oh, sure, whenever I'm ready. Alright. And also, alright. 
Ladies and gentlemen, before we leave, I'd like to thank everybody who helped with the National Rugby Boxing League this year. Sir Lebron Nicholson, just the uh, people who provided music, and everybody who has helped us out. I'd especially like to thank all the fighters who participated, Army, Box go. Fun Box for hosting us, and Kreds for being our special effects guy. Are we doing a party? And, and we will be, and we will see you next week for the Thunder no, Bowl and the end of don't the National Rugby Boxing League don't season. End it. And I will see you, and the rest of us no, will see you next no, week. Thank you for no, watching, and no, good night.